long time. Actually, I'll introduce you to some right here. These are, a, they have been skipping school. This is Ella, Jaya, and Pilar. Um, and so tell me first how old you guys are and tell me about skipping school and why and, and what that's all about. So um, I've been skipping school for 11 weeks now and it is a sacrifice that we have to make because we are missing important things, but we realize that if we don't skip this school, we might not have a future. So we need to because... And you're, you're 12 years old, is that right? Yeah. And you girls are, you're 13 and you're 12 also. And you guys are deciding at this age that you're standing up by skipping school for this. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. And, and even at your age, what does this have you thinking about sort of in a bigger picture? Is it have you thinking politically? What does it want you, what are you guys thinking about what you want to change in the world? So it kind of makes me think that in the 2020 election, I'm scared for my future. I'm scared that the politicians won't won't be declaring a climate emergency, won't be taking climate action. That's why, because I can't personally vote, and I'm begging my parents to let, to vote for the candidate that wants climate action, that wants climate, that wants to make sure fossil fuel companies don't have taxes on them. I want, like, we, I want change, and I hope my parents do too. And, and so what are you guys doing to make change right now? What type of stuff besides skipping school is making a difference? Um, well, we have been um, reducing the use of plastic and straws and, you know, all this stuff that hurts the environment, not getting plastic bags and we don't need to. We've also been educating a lot of people at our school and informing people about um, what is going on with the climate. Well, it's amazing that you guys are doing that.